this is a, a reading from The Savages, uh, which takes place between uh, Sasha, the teenage daughter, who has just started going out with uh, Jack Greenway, uh, a very outspoken, touchy-feely vegetarian. Uh, they're in the sixth form car park on their lunch break. Nobody was surprised when Jack and Sasha started dating. If anything, it should have been something that happened earlier. Instead, Jack went out with a string of older girls, most of whom had now left for university, while in her year, Sasha was just one of those types that tended to intimidate boys. She didn't do so on purpose. In a way, her striking looks could work against her. Sasha was willow tall with long, slender limbs and carried herself like a ghost in human form. You could tell she had Russian blood in her by that heart-shaped face, delicate nose and high cheekbones. Complete with the clearest blue eyes in school, she was out of this world in every way. Not that she recognised this in herself. Sasha wasn't shy, just cautious. Unfortunately, all those lads who gave it a shot found the power of speech failed them. That is, until everyone returned for the start of the new school year and Jack looked around to see what was on offer. Unlike Sasha, Jack knew that he had been blessed with good looks. Every girl in school placed him at the top of their list. Even from behind, his broad shoulders and tight hips told you this one was worth checking out when he turned. But it wasn't so much Jack's dramatically shaggy cut and easy smile that charmed as much as his manner. It was something he hoped Sasha was about to discover for herself by climbing into her orbit with such passion that anything else of importance in her life just fell away. In such a spin, her world would surely come to revolve around him. For now, however, Sasha was officially late for lessons. OK, she said, time out. I don't want to get into trouble. Another minute, eh? Jack breathed out with a faint moan and dipped down to nuzzle her throat. Oh, this isn't fair, Sasha protested weakly. She half closed her eyes for a moment, only to snap them wide open on feeling his teeth find her neck. Uh, what are you doing? Tasting you, he said, before drawing her skin between his lips. Jack! This time, Sasha pulled away. She pressed her hand to her neck, looking both shocked and surprised. A love bite? Really? Just a little gesture. Jack grinned and pushed her hand through his hair. I'm happy for everyone to know you're mine. What are you, she said, like 12 years old? Nobody does love bites anymore. Sasha examined her fingertips as if to check he hadn't drawn blood. Then she glanced back at Jack and grinned despite herself. Promise me you'll never do that again, she said. It wouldn't go down well at home.